Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to more Potion Craft. The shop is open. The bananas are hairy. We're ready to get going today. We got two dudes already in the shop ready to go. It's because we were in the middle of a day, but uh, we'll pretend that it's a new day. And uh, this dude looks like he just showed up in his damn sleeping cap to uh, ask for a potion. Well met. Me and the guys are going hog hunting. I'm sure we'll nab at least a couple. Dude, this guy, <laughs> I can tell you uh, who he voted for in the 2020 election. We'll sell one at the market, but we want to roast the other one right in the forest. We need something to get the fire going or our plans will fall through. Okay, um, pretty, pretty easy decision to make here. I will make a pyromaniac potion. Brew it, baby. Beautiful. Here you go, my friend. Selling for 64, haggling for another 19. You love to see it. We're, we're starting, you know, slowly, slowly, but surely, the money is starting to ramp up a little, you know? It's because our popularity is going up. You know, we also, are, our skill points are going up as well. Um, so things are looking good. Hey there, I've been trying to catch a mean fish. Believe it or not, the little thing breathes fire. It melted my whole rod last time. Could you give me a frost potion for my bait? This guy's just straight to the point, man. <laughs> Normally they're like, uh, well, you know, maybe something that could make it colder. Uh, if the fish swallows it, maybe the heat will back off a bit, right? Fire breathing fish? And not only. I have all the luck with strange fish. I've caught piranha and even a zombie fish once, so fire breathing fish are nothing new to me. Dude, with this guy's line, it looks like he's got this dude hooked. <laughs> <laughs> on the back of his fishing rod. So like, yeah, this, this is the firefish. He's bald. Um, okay. So you need a frost potion. Look, we, we don't have a frost potion, right? We we have a, a started frost potion. Uh, I believe, yeah, this is ice potion, but kind of crap. Yeah, okay. Um, well, continue brewing from here. And then it's just, it's just this easy, dude. We're, we're gonna get ourselves a a good frost potion uh, and it should be as simple as just doing this and then we'll bring it around and then like let, let's start the water a little bit here right just a little just a little and then down a little bit here make sure you're lined up there's a very faint little line that you may or may not be able to see because of the bit rate of the video but we should there we go okay so we will save this potion um is this dude have we i swear to god we have saved uh life in stockholm sweden like 800 times um maybe we just I, honestly at this point we never named the healing potion are you freaking kidding me? Okay, I gotta name that for sure. Um, so day in the life of, of Oslo, Norway, or whatever we, we have decided, is clearly just not working. Um, because it, it, you know, we're never saving it properly. So now we have to come up with a completely new name. This is the Siberian Synapse Slickster. <laughs> sure, why not? Um, heat this sucker up for one and then let's get a good this is a, a scraggly honestly dude i mean this is close to perfect i'm gonna tell you it's close to perfect i do like the snow although no yeah, dude i'm gonna be honest i like the snow I, I think the snow is the best best case scenario for us uh but we'll we'll make it a little bit lighter in nature um and then maybe the the second one you go like really dark on to create a little bit of contrast. We'll even have it get into kind of a, a purpley type realm. Somewhere like there. I like it, to be honest with you. Um, save recipe. Finish potion. And here you go, sir. The Siberian Synapse Slickster. Uh, haggle for an additional 16. I, we, we will not complain. An additional 16. While not much, it is honest work. Here you go, sir. Uh, gonna have to do one more small haggle dude this guy he, he's he's a toughie okay there you go get destroyed sell it get out of here recently in a tussle with some bandits and someone disarmed me 
so I had to grab one of their knives with my bare hand. He's a psycho. As you can see, I won the fight, but was left with some deep wounds that need healing. Well, this is a good opportunity um, to rename our strong potion of healing. Uh, this is... No, <laughs> we can't use... We can't use... I was about to say the N-word in our potion title, and then I realized that has a different connotation. Um, what what can we call a notch apple? This is, dude, this is the, the Jeb pear. <laughs> it's just a horrible, it's just a horrible joke. It, it's such a horrible joke. Here you go. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm so pleased with that. Uh, okay. Dude, people always want healing potions, man. They always do. Also, we're we're out of stuff. What are we out of? We're we're out of uh, Terraria. Wild, to be honest. Um, gonna have to get some more. Uh, it's Mushroom Boy. Okay. How long have you been gathering mushrooms? Fifty years. Looked good for his age. I started wandering the woods as a lad and it became my home. Then I built a hut in the woods and started coming into town just to sell the mushrooms I collect. Well, what do you got, sir? Um, we know we like... I think we like these. Yeah, we use these a lot. Um, I like those. They're expensive, though. I mean, they are super expensive. We like broccoli, too. But let's grab a couple broccoli. This is a pretty good mushroom, man. We don't have any of these. Let, let, let's snag, like, ten of those. And I like this guy, too. I like all these, to be honest. Um, we're gonna, gonna have to really haggle. Let, let's do it. I'm not, I'm not taking the sulfur shelf. We don't need it. We, we've got one, right? I, I think we're okay. We're okay on that front. Um, let's haggle. We, we desperately need to bring this down. I mean, we can get minus 108 on the deal. Um, 255, y you, you, look, you gotta pay. If you're gonna make it big in the potion making industry, you have to pay. It's just that, it's just that simple. Cockroaches have infested my cellar. They're running all over my food stores and getting in the bags of grain, it's terrible. I cannot live like this. Give me something that will get rid of those buggers once and for all. A lot of things you can use to get rid of them. Um, a weak potion of acid will do it, although will not sell for much. Um... Fire potion, theoretically. Although I will say cockroaches are like the most immune uh, creature ever, uh, which, you know, maybe an explosive potion would do it. I know that you're probably like, Tyler, you're a psycho. Do not do an explosive potion right now. Um, I'm going to make an explosive <laughs> potion. We need to anyway, okay? I I'm just, you know, we're, we're, we're making the explosive potion because it levels us up anyway. I know that cockroaches don't like bombs, right? A little birdie once told me that. Um, so, look, you make an explosive potion, you move on with your day. I, if you hate it, then you know what? Get out. How am I going to do this? Unfortunately, we may have to just use a wind bloom. I use wind bloom so much, man. Boy, we, we do not have... The, the next thing we have to prioritize is some uh, uppities. We we gotta get some uh, some some things that make us go up. That makes it sound like I'm doing drugs or something. That's not it's not my intention. Um, okay, get this to go to about. Well, let's see. Actually, um, yeah, let's get on the the downward slope. That's gonna be a good banana now, I think. Cause banana. Oh, dude, it's so good actually. We need to get over to here. This is where we want to go. So what, what do we got that can get us into that downward region? I'll be honest with you. I actually kind of like... I like getting into the spiral right on the edge. And then... Uh, I mean, the banana does do like exactly what we want, though. Okay, let, let's try... Let, let's try to let's move it along for one. We're picking up XP as we go too, which um, is more important than we probably give it credit for. It's a talent up. You like to see it. Can we pick that up and stay in the spiral? We can. Okay. Do you want to be in the spiral? Is another question. We gotta get through here. How are we gonna get through there? 
Another hairy banana, unfortunately, is how we must do it. So let, let's now move to there. Then you're going to go fire bell. And dude, it might be another hairy banana. <laughs> we're, we're in the hairy banana business at this point. Um, they're just so good. The, the swoop down to the right is a, a beautiful, beautiful thing. And the fact that we do not have a lot of terrarias, we, we have to... We have to make ends meet with this banana. So now you pop a Terraria in. And then I think it's like around here. <laughs> um, maybe it's not. I swear it is. I, I really do swear it is. Um, this is a lot of XP if we do that. We could also toss this thing in, which we still are not entirely sure what the heck it does. Um, but it would send us straight down. Okay. Let, let's... Let's do it. We, we don't know... There might be something funky going on here. I don't know. Oh, it teleports. Oh, that's super weird. Okay. Yeah, that, that's fun. Very funky. Very funky. Let's get to here. We're going on a little bit of a journey. And by little bit of a journey, I mean like we're, we're kind of... Kind of in no man's land right now. Um, dude, where are we going? Just just toss a banana in? There, there's nothing down here. Dude, I could have sworn that this was what we needed to do. To get our explosive potion. We, we have made an explosive potion, we just, it, it was during the, the misclicked non-save disaster of 2021. Unless it's somewhere else, is it up here instead? Cause this just feels like there's nothing over here, man. Do we have a shoot to the top left? I don't think we do. Um, we did just buy a bunch of these, which isn't horrible. We can see if there's anything down here. Can we upgrade? I can't upgrade this. Okay, well, we might as well do that. Now we're over here. But it's still just like, there There ain't there ain't crap down here, man. How, how could this happen to me? I, I have, uh... I have strayed so far. <laughs> from our... From our mission. I mean, we're nowhere near. I might as well, like, this is now an XP mission, right? You know, there's no reason not to just keep things uh, going here. We'll use our, our final... I guess we still have one more wind bloom. Keep in mind that we're, we're coming close to the end of the day. So we can afford to... You know, we're going to get some stuff here in the next day from the garden. And we'll probably have a, a salesman we can get to. But dude, I'm gonna be real. Um, this is this is actually like kind of a small disaster. We we have cleared out this entire area. There's no potions down here. Where the hell's the explosive potion? It's gotta be up here. I, I we we must have just not gone near it. I could have sworn it was down here. Uh, fair enough. Okay. Well, you know what? It was a a good little. Good little trek through this area. Um, got a bunch of XP, which is chill. Um, we're gonna basically just dump this. <laughs> it, it's it's a it's a shame. It's a shame because we wasted like all of our ingredients, but that's okay. You don't want a poison potion, huh? Interesting. Do you do you want a fire potion? You don't want a fire, dude. I think she wants an explosive potion. Like, I, I think that is literally it. Um, and I'm gonna tell you, I can't get up there. I, I don't have a way to shoot up to this area right now. I, I do not have the, the things necessary. We don't have enough upward action. We got one. But I, I don't... We do have this. But I, I don't... I don't think that's enough. Right? Let, let, let's mess with it, right? Let's mess with it. Um, we'll, we'll get to here. And then we'll get to... Here? 
well, go a little bit more. We, we, we're trying to get into the spiral, I think. But it's XP, again, it's XP. Got it, gotta get XP. Um, then let's get into the spiral. And then we'll heat this sucker up. That's the explosive potion, man. I, I guarantee you. So heat this up. I, I always think that I can end that pretty abruptly, and you definitely can't. Um, okay. Gotta find... Dude, I'm not gonna have a way to go up. This sucks. Okay, well, hold up. What if we go to here? Th this is big brain. This is big brain. We go to here. Then we shoot up. Honestly, we, we might... Let, let, let's let's see what happens. If I can snag a, a level one, we're gonna snag a level one. We can snag a level one. Okay, I'm gonna snag a level one. This will be an explosive potion. He's finally done it. Okay, um, just finish the recipe. It's a crappy, it's a crappy explosive potion. Okay, we have completed chapter two, which is very exciting. Um, got a bunch of XP from that. We'll increase our chance for more XP. Dude, I have nothing. Like, I, I literally have nothing. She doesn't want an explosive potion? What? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I have a crush on a young man. He doesn't feel the same, and that drives me crazy. I need a potion that will help me win his heart. Uh, she's horny, dude. This is the worst case scenario. She's horny. Um, we cannot make the bonk potion. We do not have enough resources to, to bonk her. So, I have to just say goodbye. I'm very sorry. Dude, I don't have enough resources for all these people. I'm hunting an ancient ghoul. Arrows bounce off of it, and it feels neither heat nor cold. People say it's immortal, but I saw it run into its lair to escape a storm. It's afraid of thunder and lightning. Give me a potion that harnesses that element, and I swear I can destroy this monster. Um, I'm gonna tell you, there's a 0% chance that we can make, uh... Mjolnir's Revenge. We cannot. We don't have the ingredients. This is rough. This is rough. Someone had an accident in the garden. The site is not for the faint of heart. I need the flowers and grass to grow rapidly and help me hide the mess. Dude, she killed someone in the garden. Like, 100%. Um, we, we have to get some money. Because we, we need this day to end. I need the garden to, to really have some stuff in it um and we need to buy i don't have enough money to buy this is gonna be horrible i mean th this is going to literally be horrible Th this was a terrible terrible set of days for us um we need to hope that people need these potions tomorrow um so we can sell them and get like some stuff because right now it rough like it, it really really rough so firebell's good um terraria's good wind blooms very good uh, I, honestly, we got all of the ideal stuff. Th this, this helps. This definitely helps. 11 water blooms, 8 terraria, 5 wind blooms. We, we can get through the day with this. That was a good haul, honestly. Good haul. Hello! I'm a fruit merchant, and I often have to transport goods over great distances. Some fruits tend to spoil on the road due to the heat. My friend told me I could pour a frost potion in the bottom of my cart to keep the fruits fresh for days. Luckily, frost potions are in fact one of the things that we can handle pretty easily. Uh, also, chapter 3, repair the alchemy machine. Frick. Um, potion of charm and magical vision. They, they must be on the right, because we have exhausted the left. Um, popularity level of 6, we are at 4. Chapter 3, we're gonna be here for a little while, let me tell you. Okay. So you need a uh, potion of frost, Siberian Synapse Slickster. Here you go, sir. Uh, I gotta haggle you because again, I need freaking cash. I need cash because we need a cart to come by uh, selling us not alchemy machine. I need plants. I need the herb girl to come by today. Greetings. Our unit is making ready to attack a camp of bandits tomorrow. We want to ambush them at night when their leader is there. Need something that can light up the area and blind the bandits so we catch them off guard. Uh, that sounds great. I, I love making a very basic Lesser Aurora Borealis. Brew it up. Here you go. Still selling for 55. We're, we're not upset about that. You know, all of this adds up. 
You know, as long as we keep on selling for 55 here and there, or 71, I suppose, 299 is beautiful. Yesterday, I found a stray puppy outside. When I brought it home, I saw its back leg was injured. This is the saddest story yet. Do you have a healing cream or medicine for my pet? Um, I mean, it's not really your pet. You found a stray outside and then you brought it in. Uh, but sure, I got a Jeb pair just sitting waiting for you. Here you go. I wish you would pay me more for it, um, but that's life. It is like the cheapest potion to make, so I, I get it. I get it. There you go. 47. Bang. It's the herb girl. Bless your soul. Shall we trade? I think you'll like some of my herbs. Can you give me some advice for growing them in my garden? I would like that. I would like advice. Don't you know why everything grows so fast in your garden? It's all because of the enchanted tree. Such trees are a true rarity. Practically any plant can grow next to the enchanted tree, even those that usually grow back in completely different conditions. Very interesting. Can I get another tree? <laughs> that would be ideal. Um, okay. Um... Hairy bananas are, are muchos expensivo right now, um, which sucks. I mean, that sucks, but these are super cheap, so I'm going to like legitimately basically sell you out of them. Um, you're a jolt to the left. You're a jolt to the left. You're kind of a cheaper jolt to the left, so I'm going to take like five of those. We would like... I mean, this can bring you up, but it's expensive, man. It is expensive. Um, let's see. Let's see. Do you need a potion of acid, my friend? It's so not worth it to sell that to her. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. I, I have to buy some of these. The, the hairy bananas are worth it. We, we spend all of our cash. We unfortunately, I was looking for some more jolt us up goods, and we just do not have any of them. Um, so we pay you. We're, we're happy. I mean, we got stuff to make it through the day. That's all that matters. Alchemist, I need a healing potion. Fair enough. I was chasing a thief yesterday when I tried to grab him. He got me in the hip with a dagger. Not a mortal wound, but I'm limping now. I need to recover quickly to get back to work protecting the town. Jeb Pear, here you go. Happy birthday to you. We get like 50 out of these normally. Um, it'll be like 40, 47 or something like that is our deal of the century. And as long as uh, he's happy with that deal, I'm happy with that deal. 47, get get in there. Greetings today, I need acid, don't let me down. <laughs> you better pay, man. Okay, you're, you're, you're paying. I don't mind bumping down my reputation a little bit to get a little bit of extra cash today. Um, we, we need the money. We, we been broke as hell for a little bit. Um, I'm good to sell you that for 104. Hello, I need your help. The local tavern keeper asked me to come up with a special beer for especially rowdy guests. They drink too much and accost other customers. The tavern keeper wants to be able to give them some kind of sedative beverage on the house. Any ideas? Uh, yeah, maybe they shouldn't let drunks into the tavern. Yeah, right. Then who would drink the booze and bring in the money? Every tavern has its drunks that keep the doors open. I mean, that's a great response from him, really. Um, okay. So, a sleep potion, right? That's what you're gonna need. Uh, we do have a sleep potion. Green Day's Magnum Opus. We cannot afford to brew it at the current moment because we do not have, um, this guy right here. In fact, I don't think we have the other... We don't, we don't have this guy either. So, we have to find a new way to make a sleep potion, unfortunately. Should not be too big of a problem. Let's put in a Terraria. Boink. And then we just need some shoot to the right, boys. Um, this Tangleweed will actually, like, kind of get the job done. Um, we'll do one of those. We'll do another one of those. And then we should just be able to do, like, a, a Water Bloom. Um, yeah, we'll do a water bloom. We, it doesn't need to be a level three, right? As long as we're getting a little bit out of this guy, that's all that matters. This is a freaking journey that this guy's taken, though. And we're, we're getting, honestly, a lot of XP from this as well. Uh, okay, it's a level one. 
do do we care? I mean, I guess this this is going to just basically turn it into a level two. I think we're good with that. Heat it up, finish it up, sell it. That's fine. We'll, we'll haggle you a little bit. It's not a level three, so we're not getting the level three, you know, costs out of this. But um, that's life, man. I mean, sometimes you can't you can't do all level threes. Popularity level five, baby. That's great. That's great. Things are going to start. You know, we're going to get a little bit more money out of this. The person I need to, let's say, take care of goes to the bathhouse. <laughs> bath, bath health? Bath house a lot. They find the steam quite good for their health. Do you have anything to add to a bucket of water to make the steam less healthy? Okay. Um. I mean, look. Acid is definitely fair poison is also like totally fair the fact that we can't freaking do poison right now is very surprising to me um let let's let's get a poison potion we'll try that first i i think that that's like the most realistic approach that we can take here um this is dude this is a pretty efficient recipe if i'm being honest with you I bet we could tweak that to become a level 3 if we wanted to, but we'll sell him a level 2. Yeah, he's good with it. Uh, I would pay more for something higher grade. Okay. Okay. I I understand. I, I do. And I probably should not have settled for a level 2 there. Especially because when you have these kinds of clients, man. They, uh... They pay a little more anyway. Now, our other one is only a two-ingredient poison potion, isn't it? It's just a requires... Yeah, it's a two-ingredient. It just requires a weird shroom. Bang! Because this is going to be a... This will be a, a three-banger for us to get a level three. And even then, I mean, it might be even a little bit more than that. Because we got to find a way to... Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do one of... That's not where I wanted... That's not what I wanted to do. Put that on the side, man. Th this is... I kind of did it again, but I think we'll be okay. Then you gotta put this in. Okay. And then we just have to be very, very cautious with this one. Slight line... Water. Okay, your line is ever so slightly off. Just bring her back a tiny bit. Water. It's a level two. I mean, that's that's pretty good, man. Just just give me a level three so I can give this guy a level three. There we go. Okay. Do I like this recipe? No, I do not. Um, heat it up. Don't save it. Our, our other one is significantly better. But here here's your strong potion of uh, poison. We're, we're going to get 65 out of this. Was it worth it? Ah, dude, I I don't know. <laughs> that it honestly probably was not worth it in the end. But you make do with what, the, with what you got. And then you also have a, a half-started tangleweed down here. Or thorn stick, whatever the heck it is. Go to bed. Um... Was it a good day? It was okay. It was okay. A, a full garden and then having somebody come by uh, in the morning shop-wise will help. A lot of fire belt. Dude, I just, it's, a, it's a great supply of our basic ingredients, which does help us out a lot. Uh, it was not a lot of ingredients, to be fair. Like, I want more, but that's life. Um, and wizard boys here, yeah. Isn't it time to add a couple pages to your recipe book? I just happen to have dozens of enchanted paper on me. He's making a mint off me, dude. Where do you get it from? I happen to know many mages and enchanters. I buy in large quantities, use some of it myself, and sell the rest as small markup. I do this not for the money, but to maintain good relations with other alchemists. Will you buy a couple? No, probably not. To be honest, I want your damn alchemy machine. I don't need pages right now. We, we theoretically have... You know, this is an ice potion, but crappy, so we can erase it. This is a... We don't even know what the hell this is, so we, we can scrap that, too. 
We got six pages, man, that we can fill up in here. I don't need your paper. I need this. That's what I need. Um, and I we just can't afford it right now. Unless I start, like, really selling some stuff. I, I, I think I could sell him every single thing in my stock. Okay? And I still don't think that we would ever... I, I just want to see what would happen, right? If I put everything in here, and then I uh, ask for the alchemy machine, he still won't do it. So it's a no from me, um, unfortunately. Goodbye. And unfortunately, it's the end of the episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, this has been Potion Craft. We'll be back uh, next episode. Dude, our reputation is fricked. I got to start turning down some of the, the sketchy people, I think. Um, but we'll be back next episode to hopefully uh, start making some good cash. Our popularity level actually is, is also going down, I think, maybe. I don't know. Um, but stuff is getting more expensive. And that's good. That's very good. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. You have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.